What up, boys? It's your boy, Marty IT, back with another video. So today we're going to be talking about my car. We're going to do a review, why I, got, why I got it and what car I had before. So if the people who knew me, I had a 2008 Infiniti G37 Coupe. It was almost FBO, sort of thing. It had an intake, exhaust, fuel pump upgraded. And we took, I'm going to put a picture of what happened to it, how I got total and why the reason I got the Durango. So, I got the Durango because I like Mopar, so, and I like V8s. So I said, if I'm gonna go, I was thinking about getting a scat pack, but I, I went to test drive it and all this other stuff. I got a proof for it, but I like, can my kit fit in this car? And then I thought about it, my, my kit cannot fit. He's only eight months and he's already two feet and a half. And I was like, how how I'm gonna put my kid on a scat pack that are small in the back? So I said, let me get a Durango. It got three seats, it's a Hemi, it's a V8. It's slow, but the plans I have it to keep it for all five years, I'm gonna have to pay for it. I'm gonna make it not fast, fast, but I'm gonna make it these type of power. But if y'all keep on my channel, you're gonna see every step I do with this car. I only had the car for three weeks and I already had a muffle, uh, muffle delete. I tinted my windows. I put I put lights in the in the in the scoops in the front. I'm gonna show you later. I tinted my tail lights and then I look up uh, order. I have lowering springs in the house. I got installed in the car, but I just want to show you the whole car, show you the specs. Because some people tell, ask me, oh, why you didn't get the leather? Me personally, I don't like cars full leather. So I, I got with the suede and leather. So I'm going to show you the whole car. I hope you enjoy it. I'm going to try my best to make it the video real nice and all that. All right, catch you in a minute. Uh, the first thing, my my car is a 2018, no, my fault, 19, the Wrangle RT. So the RT comes with the 5.7, and the 2019 come with that front end. If you look at the old ones, they don't come with that front end. Those they took off the wide body Hellcats, scat packs, and RTs. You can see they got the extra little scoop in the, right there. The little scoop and don't mind those little holes right there that was at the dealership put front plates i do not want front plates in this car so right there i did four lights right now i only have three installed because i didn't want to take my front bumper off to put the one in the bottom so i got one in that grill and then one in the scoop and i'm missing that bottom one and i got one in the engine bay all in the back. I'm gonna show you that in a couple minutes, but let's walk around the car. The car comes with the rims. They came black stock. That's the only thing they came with. And then I got a sunroof. The car is full loaded. I got the suede with the leather interior. Y'all gonna see in the pictures that I'm gonna be posting. I got CarPlay, I got everything. Backup camera, I got camera when I'm driving forward, I can put the ones in the back ones. And you can see, I put carbon fiber, uh, little details, and then I put the power shifters, I extend them, and I put them red. And this is all wheel drive car, so if y'all wanna check out how I do the burners in this car, I'm gonna have a video explain that how to do a burnout in a Durango so right now I'm running 265 in the back 50 20s so I don't got a lot of meat my plan is to put three or fives all around and you know that's when I'm making a little more power 
Right now the car's stock. The car's making 340 to the wheels. Next thing I can see is the tail light. It tinted out. I'm gonna picture. I'm gonna put a picture in the next slide when it was wasn't tinted. And if you notice, I took all the 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 Wrangle and the RT and the logo they had. Y'all yeah, gonna see in the same picture. And what else I did to it? Oh, I did a mid muffler, uh, mid muffler delete. Y'all yeah, gonna see another video. That's another video y'all yeah, gonna see. But I'm gonna start it up so y'all can hear the sounds. It's warm because I'll be driving already. Yeah, I can see the, the tail light to look very good, nice. I was thinking about maybe changing those and putting carbon fiber where the black is right now. But I don't know. I don't know. I might do that. And then I put this window guards. I think that's what they call right, right here. So when it rains, I don't get right inside the car. It just flies out. And I think my, and I got low, lowering suspension. I'm going to show you a clip. What suspension I got and why that got why I got those? The car is gonna go two inches down. And I'm gonna get some rims, but I don't have I don't have the rims. I only have the suspension right now. I don't know if I should do it now or next summer. I'm still thinking about it. But let's get into a car so I can show you a little bit of how it looks in the car. So you can see the car has twenty one thousand miles on it. And I got my display right there. And the options I was telling you about. The back camera I can put it when I'm driving or whatever. But it's not it's nice, it's nice. I like the car. The car drives good. It's not fast. Everybody knows me. I used to like I like to race a lot in East Wash. But now I calm down. I'm not saying I'm not gonna race no more, but I must, I must still do some little work to it. And I'm open the hood so I can see the inside of the hood, how it looks and all that other stuff. So I'm gonna show you under the hood right now. Y'all gonna see the, the light set up. It's a little sloppy because I am, I was rushing. So y'all can see the little strip. Y'all can even see that I even taped them on because you can still see the red tape. It's, I just put zip ties. And I got those there and then I got the ones in the scoop. That's in there. And y'all can see the Hemi. It's a Hemi 5.7. Y'all can see there's a stock intake, stock throttle body, everything in stock, but not for long. Y'all keep going with my video, y'all gonna see every mile I do to this car, the change. The first, the uh, 5.7 Mare to the top, top in Wisconsin. I know a lot, of, I haven't seen a lot of YouTubers Modern Durango's because people be like, "Why well, must why well, must I'm gonna do a Durango if I can get a scat pack?" That's why. That's one reason I got the car because I want to mod it. I want to be that one YouTuber that modify his car to make a certain number. I'm not gonna say it because I know there's a lot of people out there talking, talking that I'm just saying stuff. But like I said. People who know me, everything I say, I do it. Y'all can see what I've done to the car in two weeks. I already got suspension, tints, headlights. And next, I'm gonna do, like, I got an appointment for this. I ordered the, the lights for the bottom and the circle in there. So I got those two lights coming in. I got my four light, I got the four lights coming in too. Changing colors. And then after that, I'm gonna do the bottoms. The same ones I have here, I'm gonna do in the bottom of the car. And, it's, and the car is gonna be two inch lower. So if you see, I got a, almost a three inch gap right there. So it's the, the car is gonna be right there when I lower it. So stay tuned. I hope y'all enjoy the video.